What's going on guys? Etika from the Etika World Network here to bring you yet another Pokemon X and Y music review. Now this one's going to be a little bit of a blast of the past. I originally reviewed the YouTuber 6061 um, recomposition of the Pokemon X and Y main trainer battle theme. However, thanks to all the leaking that Nintendo's been doing from its ass cavity lately, we now have the official um, the official composition of the trainer battle theme so no longer do we have like just a recomp But we have the actual official thing thanks to all these leaks So what you and I are going to do today is basically do a let's listen of this new Trainer battle theme that just got released and we know for a fact that this one is the official one Simply because people were able to really rip the song away from the 3ds using sound capture systems That are plugged into the audio jack while the demo was playable at certain areas without any delay Let's get into listening into what this new trainer battle theme sounds like. It's probably going to be very similar to the YouTuber 6061 mix, simply because it was pretty much the same song, just in the way that he heard it. But whatever the case may be, let's actually go in and listen and see what the song is all about. It's got... It's got the same feel, like I said. It will definitely sound similar, but I don't know. It, it, there's something about it that definitely feels different, that's for sure. Yeah, like this part was different in YouTuber 6061's mix. I guess I'm feeling it. actually got this really accurate, like, his mix was really close to this one, but there's a difference. Yeah, for the official theme, I think it's... Hmm. Let me give it one more and listen to, because it's like... I like YouTubers mix a lot, but maybe that could just simply be the fact that I got used to it since that was the only rendition of the Train of Battle thing we had. So I kind of don't want that bias to affect the way I think about this, but it's kind of difficult in that sense because I've already had the YouTuber mix to listen to. And I think that it's a little bit more upbeat. It has a little bit more tempo than this one does. Like the tempo of YouTubers mix was more constant, but this one kind of slows down in some parts. It doesn't seem as proactive. Super 661 mix. Let's see. Like, I like YouTubers mix when it came to this part. It sounded a lot better, and the rock and the guitars were better than that. But, oh well. It still sounds cool. It still has a nice sound to it. Like, this part wasn't a YouTube mix either, but, I mean, alright, so, so one thing I can definitely say is that its tempo is not as constant as YouTubers. Second, it has the great guitars in it, but I just like the fact that YouTubers mix seems to feel a little faster, it felt a little bit more alive, but this one's alright. Yeah, I mean, I think I've heard enough, like, I think I've definitely heard enough, that's, that's it. Um, alright, so, that was basically the Pokemon X and Y trainer battle theme, and to be honest, I definitely don't really feel it as much as YouTubers Mix, but most likely that's because YouTubers Mix was the one that I was listening to, so it probably is a reason of just preference at this point, but if I had to grade the trainer battle theme right now, it definitely gets a good score. But since I am a Sonic the Hedgehog fan, I'm not going to do this in ways of 1 to 10. I'm going to rank this in ways of letter grading. So for this, I'll give it a, 
I'll give it a B minus while YouTuber 6061's mix gets a B plus. Simply because it's a little bit more proactive and those guitars are that much more crisp in YouTuber 6061's mix rather than over here. But you're still good, Pokemon Company. You still got a great sounding battle theme. And eventually, I think that preference and constantly listening to it will raise it over the other renditions. But at this point now, YouTubers are seeming really, really strong. Anyways, that doesn't really matter too much because I want to know what you guys think. Which one do you think comes out on top? Let me know in the comments below. Did you like the grading of B- minus on this thing? Let me know in the comments below as well, but I ain't going to hold up no more of your time. Thank you for tuning into this edition of the Pokemon X and Y Music Review, and I'll talk to you guys on the flip side. Take care of yourselves, and of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.